Lauren, it is super busy here at Jerry's Foods in Edina, as you said, and you can see here behind me, it is like a madhouse here. It has been crazy busy from sunrise to sunset. People trying to get those last minute groceries in stock for obviously the storm tonight and obviously Thanksgiving, just a couple of days. But apart from that grocery shopping, people also trying to get their snowblowers ready and their cars is ready as well. Big crowds and long lines. Eddie Dinah's Jerry's Foods for Thanksgiving. Right now I'm looking for Fritos and I couldn't find them the other day either. Do you know where the Fritos are? Barb though is doing some winter storm shopping. Okay, thank you. Snacks, you bet. Just in case. Make sure I don't run out of anything over the, with, during the storm. On top of food shopping, then your snowblower will still last you. St. Paul's Merriam Park repairs phones are ringing off the hook. What can we do for you? People needing last minute snowblower repairs. Well, it's inevitable. Bringing everybody in the door. That's for sure. Mechanic Ben Wilk says it's been nonstop. I did a full tune-up, so it's ready Perfect. to go. Machines right here are waiting to get fixed. So busy, some are unable to be fixed by first snowfall. Oh, and don't forget your car tune-ups. This week we've been doing 15 to 20 cars a day at this location alone. Ethan Derry's crew at Signal Garage Auto Care is doing what we call winterizing cars. You know, once, once snow comes into the picture, uh, tires are the big thing. It's definitely tire season. All in all, a busy Tuesday. There it goes. But no panicking, at least for now. Bring it on. I love the snow, and I don't mind the winter. Yeah, very busy day indeed. I did speak to the manager here at Jerry's Foods. Despite what happens with this storm tonight, he hopes to be open, expects to be open until midnight tonight, and then whatever happens, he expects to be back open at 6 a.m. tomorrow with all those last-minute shoppers.